Welcome into the third rendition of the Sports Report here on UCF TV. Alongside Naz Perez, I'm Ryan Bass, and as we're rocking and rolling into the show today. We sure are, Ryan. We're talking national championship college basketball, Jeff Godfrey in the running for the Heisman, and is UCF among the top athletic programs in the nation? Play Take Your Pick with UCF Football Zone Chad Hounshell, as well as reveal our videos of the week. That's all coming up right here on the Sports Report. It's time for my favorite part of the show, Naz, where you, the fans, get your voice in. We're polls time here. So, Naz, let's start off. UCF got some really good PR this week from SportyNews.com as the Knights were ranked number four in the country in mid-major programs behind TCU, Boise State, and BYU. So, Naz, do you agree with their rankings? Should they be higher, or, or do, you, do you think they even deserve to be in the top ten? I mean, I think they should be higher, Ryan. Um, I don't see why there's no reason we can't be number three. I can see why TCU's first with their invitation to the Big East. Boise State's got head coach Chris Peterson. You know, a lot of people go there to play for him. But I'm not willing to give up the three spot to BYU, and I'll tell you why. They were 7-6 and six last year, and we're coming off our best season in program history. So I think UCF should be number three, and I think we'll prove that when we play BYU later this year. And again, they do play them, as you mentioned. And, like, listen, four's good for them right now. They play BYU this year on the road, which is going to be a huge test for them to see what they can do. If they have another 10, 11 win season this year, uh, can actually move up in the rankings. I see no reason why this team couldn't be top three. Now, they're going to have to make a move into a, a, another conference, whether it be Big East, Big 12, to be able to really get to those top tier programs like TCU and Boise State. But until they do that, I think number three could be a spot that they could attain. Of course, it all will depend on what they do this year with BYU. All right, night fans. Well, Ryan says three, I say three, and you guys voted. 75% of you said that they are good at the number four spot. And, so, it, and again, they're making number. progress. This team they're is making this program. Progress. So four right now is good, but hey, we're coming for that top three. I promise you. We're coming for it. So whether you agree UCF should be in the number four spot or not, they've shown they've had some success in the past year. They've enjoyed top 25 rankings in football, basketball, and baseball. And check this out, Ryan, only 10 schools in the nation can share that honor. So Ryan, has UCF reached the top tier in the country in athletics yet? That's amazing, Naz, but listen, they're close. They need to change conferences. I mean, whether it be Big East, Big 12, any conference they can make to go to, to have a shot at an automatic qualifying bid, that's what this team needs. They are close. They've enjoyed so much success, and they're starting to get those top recruits in the state of Florida. They're really making noise around the country. But until they make something other than a lateral move, they can't be compared to those programs like Texas, Ohio State, or, or even in their own state with Florida and Florida State. Yeah, um, and I'm just thinking UCF top tier. I mean, that's a big argument to make. There's, I don't think there's any way that we're close. So don't get me wrong. We had a great year, but to be considered a top tier program in the nation, I think we're going to have to show a little bit more consistency, you know, than just having one really good year. Yeah, again, I think they're finally getting there. You know, in the state of Florida, they're, I think they're involved in that top three, but, you know, it's going to take some time until they get into that those tops in the nations. Well, we'll see what you guys think. We're going to head to the polls. Does UCF deserve a top tier ranking in the country among top schools? And 62% of you said no, but they are close. So that was good, Ryan. 62. That's a more than half. That's pretty good. It's a pretty good percentage of you. So CBSSports.com released a poll earlier last week asking the question, which Florida school will finish highest in 2011? Of course, we all know what UCF did last year, but Florida and Florida State really shined. And Florida, you know, they had an off year, but still did pretty good as well. So, Naz, where will UCF finish among Florida schools in 2011? Well, Ryan, I'm going to go with fourth. You know, you can't expect Florida, UM, or Florida State to be down for long. You know, Florida State's ranked number three next season. Florida's Florida, you know, and they just might win another championship. And Miami has a lot of senior leaders coming back, you know, and a new really exciting head coach. So I say that we're good at the number four spot. Listen, I, they, they really, I'm going to have to go with third in this because you look at what UCF was able to do this year. Now, USF has always given them a problem with the runnings. A lot of teams compare the, both of those as the, pretty much get the two schools confused. But I'll tell you, I think UCF is finally starting to get their name away from U South Florida. You saw what they did with that win in the Liberty Bowl over Georgia beating an SEC team. They got ranked in the top 25 last year for the football team. So... I think what you see this year is, again, FSU I think is going to have a great year. I think they're going to have 11 wins as well. But I wouldn't be surprised if UCF was second in that. I'm going with third, but I wouldn't be surprised well, with eight. Florida. We'll see what happens with the coaching change, how they're going to do with Muschev as their coach there. But, again, I wouldn't be surprised if they get into that top two. I'm going to go with three as my safe bet right now. We'll 